Do you want to install Android apps and games on your Ubuntu laptop or desktop? In this video, I am going to show how to run Android apps on Ubuntu with Google Play Store. If you are trying to run Android apps on Ubuntu, Vdroid is the best tool to do it. It allows you to run a complete Android system within the Ubuntu desktop. It also has the Google Play Store, so you can easily download and install all of your favorite Android apps and games on your Ubuntu PC. I'll show how you can run APK files on this Android system. So without any further ado, let's get started. Before we proceed to install Vdroid, you need to switch from the older Zorg display server to the Wayland display server on your Ubuntu system. To do so, log out of your user account. Then on the lock screen, click the gear icon. Here it shows two display options. You need to select Ubuntu on Wayland. After that, log in to your user account again. Now if you go to the about section in the settings app, you should see that Wayland is your selected display system. Now we can proceed to install Vdroid on Ubuntu. So open the terminal window. First of all, run this command to install the curl tool, which is necessary for running Vdroid's installation script. After that, run this command and add Vdroid's official repository using curl. Now, install the Vdroid package. After the Vdroid installation is completed, make sure to update your system's package list. Now, you can open Vdroid from the Applications menu. On the first launch, you should get this initialize Vdroid window. Here, click the Android type option and choose Caps to integrate Google Play services. Then hit the download button to begin downloading and installing your Android container. In case the Vdroid initialize window doesn't show up during the first launch, you can also download Caps by running this command in the terminal. After downloading is completed, start the Vdroid Android system. Upon the first setup, you will get this notification indicating that the device is not Google Play Protect certified. It means this device cannot run Google Apps and Services. So now, you need to certify this Android device, as without it, you cannot install Android apps and Vdroid via the Google Play Store. To manually register your device with Google, you need to know your device's Android ID. To get the Android ID, you just need to run a command in the terminal. Enter sudo vdroid shell. Then execute this command to display your device's Android ID. After you have found your ID, you have to submit it to Google for device verification purposes. To do this, visit the Google's uncertified page. Enter your Android ID here. Click the register button. With your Android device registered with Google, wait a few minutes to reflect the changes.
After relaunching, check the notification panel. The Play Protect notification should be gone now. You can now go ahead and set up your new Android device. As you can see, the interface is just like an Android smartphone or tablet. From the top, you get the quick settings panel and notifications panel. From the settings, you can change the stuff as you need. At the bottom, it has back, home and recent apps button. Swipe up from the bottom to access the app drawer where all your app icons appear. Now, let's open the Google Play Store app. Using the Play Store, you can install all your favorite Android apps and games as you do on any other Android device. Guys, if for some reason the Google Play Store didn't work, you can also run APK files on Vaidroid. To install an APK file, open the terminal in the folder where the APK file is located. Then use this command to install the app on your system. After installation, the app icon should appear on the Vaidroid app drawer. Most Android apps and games will run quite well on this platform. So give Vaidroid a try and install your favorite Android apps with it on your Ubuntu desktop. Later, if you want to remove Vaidroid from your system, just enter these commands one by one. This will uninstall Vaidroid and delete all its data from your system. <laughs> 